almost got me. They really almost, they came this close to really beating any curiosity out of me. Uh, by the time I was in third grade, I'd had a, a good buddy of mine, Rick Ferentino, and the only way we had fun was to create mischief. We used to do things like, um, well, I remember one time we traded everybody. That there was a big bike rack where everybody put their bikes, maybe 100 bikes in this bike rack, and we traded everybody our lock combinations for theirs on an individual basis, and then went out one day and put everybody's lock and everybody else's bike, and it took them until about 10 o'clock that night to get all the bikes unsorted. And stuff like that. We'd set off explosives in teachers' desks and stuff. and It was, it was pretty serious. We got kicked out of school a lot. And, and it, in fourth grade, I encountered one of the other saints in my life, which was... Uh, I, they discovered they were going to put me and this guy, Rick Ferentino, into the same fourth grade class, and the principal said at the last minute, no, no, bad idea, separate them. So this teacher, Mrs. Hill, said, I'll take one of them, and she taught the advanced fourth grade class, and thank God I was the, the random one that got, got put in her class. And um, she watched me for about two weeks, and she then approached me. She said, Stephen, I'll, I'll tell you what, I, um, I'll make you a deal. I have this math workbook, and if you take it home and finish it on your own without any help, and you bring it back to me, if you get it 80% right, I will give you $5 and one of these really big suckers. She bought it. She held it out in front of me, one of these giant things. And I looked at her like, are you crazy, lady? You know, nobody's ever done this before. And, of course, I did it. And she basically bribed me back into learning. Uh, with 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 uh, candy and money and and what was really remarkable was that you know before very long I had such a respect for her that I I'd sort of reignited my desire to learn and she was remarkable she um, she got me kits for making cameras you know I ground my own lens and made a camera and, and it was it was really quite wonderful uh, and I think I probably learned more academically that one year than I've ever learned in my life. Um, and it, was, it, was, it created problems, though, because when I got out of fourth grade, um, they, wanted, they tested me and they decided to put me in high school.